It's been 40 years since a woman competed in Formula One, something these Japanese drivers want to change. They're members of an all-women team taking part in F4, an entry-level competition seen as a stepping stone to the big time. It is still very far off, and it even seems impossible. But I think you need to dream big. I want to be an F1 driver, and to get there, I want to achieve my goals, one by one. 21-year-old Ayaka Imahashi had to first overcome parental opposition to her love of racing. And now she is challenging stereotypes. A woman behind the wheel attracts attention because it's rare. But we should not stick by that. We are not there for decoration. You have to give your all to get results. And once that happens, nobody will think of us as mere window dressing. Italian Lella Lombardi was the last woman to go head to head with the men in Formula One back in the 1970s. And for some, there's no reason why more women can't also make the grade. Okay, there's some difference in the physical stuff and uh, it's a blah, 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 blah. Uh, in the okay when you go out in the circuit there's nothing different I think. so all the all the complex stuff so nothing different nine Japanese drivers have raced in F1 more than any other Asian country and now Miki Ayaka and the rest are gearing up to emulate them and strike a blow for women around the world <laughs>